I thought this would be a good video topic to go over how I ball my tungsten. Um, I'm going to show you guys two different ways. One just by changing the balance on the machine and one by um, flipping the polarity. So we'll go through that. Uh, these are just two pieces of laser 330 second tungsten that I cut there with the bench grinder as you've seen. Um, and then I normally just put you know, a decent point on it and let it ball down. So the first way, we'll just do it basically with the balance on the machine. You're gonna go all the way to electrode positive. That's the only thing I'll change. So if I'm well, if I'm in the middle of a weld, I leave my amperage and my free, everything the same. All I do is crank the balance up. So I have the tungsten set up in the torch, just like you would if you were welding. Um, I'm gonna bring it down to the plate to where the cup is square with the plate. It's not leaning one way, because the ball will end up forming weird, just nice and square. I'm just gonna hold a small gap and I'm gonna bring the heat on very slow. That ball will start to form instantly. If you mash the pedal too hard, it's just gonna, the tungsten will explode. So you just bring the heat on very gradual and you'll see that ball start to form. So we'll go ahead and do that. shut the torch off I like to hold it there and keep the gas on it it's hard to see in the video there it is nice small ball now if you want to do a bigger ball a larger ball on it I'll show you guys how to do that too you can do it the same way but what I found works better is just flipping the polarity on the machine so the other way to ball it is come to the machine, go from AC to DC. You're gonna take your torch and your ground and you're gonna flip them. Just like that. Everything else is exactly the same here with how I got it set up. And I'm gonna put a larger ball on it this time. And there you have it. Just don't forget to switch it back to AC before you start welding. <laughs> 